ABC 21 is your weather authority and we have team coverage tonight with Matt and Matthew joining us now with more. Yeah, that's right, Crystal. I'll have more on what to expect a little bit later tonight, but first we're going to check in with meteorologist Matthew Bullock off of Coliseum Boulevard with a look at current conditions. Matthew, how's it going outside? Well, Matt and Krista, April has been living up to its reputation of a wild month for weather. Just in the past seven days, we've seen temperatures highs in the upper 70s. We've seen thunderstorms, hail, rain, even some flurries this morning. Now, the biggest thing you probably noticed today was probably the wind gust. Now, the wind gusts at the official reporting station at the airport have been consistently over 30 miles an hour. And at times, we've seen winds gusting up to 50 miles an hour. I spoke with a few residents who are out at the post office to share their thoughts on the weather swings. I just can't believe it's already April and it's still like this. <laughs> um, we just keep getting thrown curveballs, but here we are. Fort Wayne weather, man. Uh, something we always have to deal with. I think it's killing our golf club. Uh, I'm a pin seeker and we were playing golf in 70 degree weather three, three days ago and now we got to take a break. So far, according to the reports, the maximum wind gust at the airport was at 44 miles per hour. Now the storm is strengthening while it's moving towards the northeast, but this is bringing us wind chill factors in the 30s, even into the 20s for us. Expect more cold nights and chillier afternoons for us. But for more details, I'm going to send it back to Matt. Yeah, thanks, Matthew. When everything else is uncertain in the world, at least we know that April is about what we expect it to be in, in the Indiana and Ohio, right? Uh, the wind chills, the strong wind. Here's a look at some of the, uh, the strong uh, wind gusts today by county, too. Uh, it's been just, you know, well, windy is kind of an understatement in many areas. Allen County, 52 miles per hour.